Disclaimer. Due to the blind run nature of this project, expect plenty of failure. This failure may include but not be limited to reading enemies with my face, getting up close and personal with death spikes, having bad ideas and sticking to them, obsessing over hidden items with unknown locations, taking a while to guess boss weaknesses, possible audio skipping and more drop frames than usual, and death. Lots and lots of death. Enjoy. Hello, Ron Mithril here once again. We're playing something a bit different here while I deal with some kind of burnout on Battle Network 4. We will be continuing it, but I want to at least get something going on the channel in the meantime. So, AD20XDX. Mega Man has defeated the evil Dr. Wily time and time again. It's thanks to him that the world is able to enjoy such a time of peace. Dr. Wily has not been heard from in years, and yet, a new threat looms over the horizon. Robots begin attacking the city. Could this be Dr. Wily yet again? What's happening? I don't know, but it's certainly nothing good. My metal brothers and sisters, we are more than mere tools for the humans. Why should they control us? What's to stop us from having free will? We must rise up, and together we will take back the world for ourselves. If you humans try to oppose us, you will be destroyed. Oh no. Proto Man, what do you think you're doing? Why is this happening? Something doesn't seem right about this. I know my brother, and he would never say something like this. You plan on putting a stop to all this, don't you? I have to. I need to live up to my title as a... Super Fighting Robot! We have a title drop! Thank you, Mega Man. We're all counting on you. Don't worry, I'll get to the bottom of this. Proto Man, this isn't like you. I don't know exactly what's going on, but I won't allow you to hurt anyone. And so, yes, we're going to be doing a blind run of Mega Man Super Fighting Robot, a fan game created by Matthew St. George, Mr. Weird Guy. Okay, so before we actually start things up here, a bit of history with this game. I was actually invited to participate in a closed beta of the game. Unfortunately, when I downloaded the beta, it did not work on my system. So I talked to the creators, and we kind of came to the shared opinion that it was a conflict between the engine they were using and the fact that I still use Vista. So, unfortunately, it just seemed like something I wasn't going to be able to play. A bit later, I participated in the House Talk podcast hosted by Horikawa Otane, they did an episode where they were talking all things Mega Man, so they wanted me to guest on that one. The subject of fan games came up, and we talked about Super Fighting Robot, and I mentioned the problem I had with the beta. Horikawa pointed out that Rock Force was made using the same engine. So I thought, well, let me try getting the finished version of the game and see if it works. And lo and behold, it did. So, let's go for it. So, we have our stage select here. So, full disclosure, I did play a bit of the Wizard Man stage just to make sure that the game worked on my system. So, that's the one we're going to be starting with. Let's go for it. Just to get what little I do know of the game out of the way. And even then, it's only like about maybe two or three rooms that I played. So, for those wondering why I picked Wizard Man first, basically I've just always really liked the whole magic aspect of various things. Uh, for example, in Skyrim, my main character mostly focused on magic. So I can't really give a fair first reaction to these guys, because I figured out how they worked in the short time I was playing this just for testing purposes. They fire as soon as you do, and the shots that they fire will block your shots. So to deal with them, you kind of need to jump, shoot in midair, and then get what counter hits you can. We also have this gimmick. That's kind of cool. And of course, while they're hiding in the hats, they do reflect your shots. 
We also have this fire wizard here that likes to try and telefrag you. And this one that's immune as long as it's charging up. Yeah, I haven't quite figured out how to dodge that yet. And we have flying magic books. That's another thing I always thought was kind of cool. I really want a haunted book Pokemon. Like a reward for having all the unknown or something. That'd be cool. You're positioned a little bit more problematic. There we go. Okay, it's just two bolts. Good to know. All right. And this is about where I stopped. So from here on out, we're in uncharted territory. Okay, we've got a magic wand. Oh, uh, of course we have these. Okay, so the crystals that the wand drops, they will stop your shots. Almost had it. Okay, so the pattern here is pretty easy to follow. It's pretty straightforward overall. There we go. I don't think I actually... Huh. So we have different possibilities of what to do here. Are these coming back? There we go. Maybe I just don't want to fall? Well, I guess we're going to find out. Yeah, okay. That's what I figured. All right. Yoku blocks. Do I have anything? Okay, I've got Rush Coil. So no cheesing this. That wasn't so bad. Whoa! Uh... Gonna guess I don't want to run into those. Okay, yeah, I do not want to run into those. Science has been conducted this day. Hmm. Okay, there's a wand in here somewhere. I think I took it out. Okay, you can't shoot these, so... I guess this is just how badly do you want some cash. I want it! Oh no! Oh, I fell for it! I'm gonna have to come back here. Unless... Do I want to know where the last checkpoint was? Going for it. Okay, that actually works out perfectly. <laughs> okay. So, let's actually go get that thing this time. Tempting as all the shinies are, we've got bigger shinies to go get. They tricked me! So a bit of a detour of death, but I think it was worth it overall. Okay, I can't reach high enough to get rid of you. Oh, not the Telefrag Wizards again. Huh. Really? Okay. 
All right, so what are you doing? Okay, just snaking back and forth. That's... Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. No, no, no. Ow. <laughs> well, that was clumsy, but we got through it. I like this stage. Pretty trippy. Just realized I never checked to see. Okay, yeah, you do have a charge shot, for those wondering. I still just tend to prefer not to use them. Oh, those look decidedly more deadly than the, uh, the little electric sigil things. I don't think I want to fall into that. Ow. Those wizards are good at making me panic. And, well, I was bound to get hit with one of those at some point. My greed for shinies, it knows no bounds! Hmm. Oh! Wow, completely changes the background. That looks kinda cool, actually. I like that touch. Yeah, I figured there had to be something good in there. Okay, you guys are not as bad as I thought. The fire wizards, though, they make me nervous. Okay, yeah, you guys, you're no problem. Oh boy, alright. Proto Man gets his own symbol. Okay. Hi there, Wizard Man. Okay, what can you do? Okay, slight homing shots. Oh! Okay, so far you don't seem too bad. Oh. Well, you just have all the elements, don't you? You're kind of cool. I like this fight. Well, came pretty close for a first attempt. Okay, how am I doing as far as equipment? Still got one life. I want to hold off on using the E-Tank until it's my last life. But this fight seems very doable. I need to react better to that. Not jumping quickly enough. Jump too soon there. There we go. That was a close one. But that's an interesting fight. I really like that one. That was pretty cool! <laughs> oh man, I love having new bosses to fight in this game. Always fun. Alright, so what did we get from that? Oh, nice colors. I really like that palette. Magic missile. We can attack the dark. Oh, <laughs> and I went ahead and got Rush Jet. Okay, I picked a good starting point. <laughs> I can accept that. Okay, and so we have a save system. So let's go ahead and do that. 
All right. And so with that, that's one down, seven to go. And so we shall resume this next time. Already, I am really liking this game. That was a super fun stage and a really nice boss fight. I like that. So with that, that's where we're going to call it for now. We are going to resume this really quick because I want to play some more. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far. And I shall see you again next time. Until then, fare thee well.